Brothers and sisters, what's happening? And this is another edition of Stop and Smell the Roses. You know, sometimes you just gotta focus on things and pay attention, open up that old pineal gland. And you know, thank my brothers and sisters that's doing their thing out there. My generals, brother or sister in our families, child, adult, whoever out there that, you know, when I say child, I mean like teenage, anyone that has a stable mind, you know, and all about facts and things, the real things we feel within our mind, body and soul, some always say. And some I wanted to touch on, my generals, that remember, we leaders and teachers, we are not followers. We are leaders and teachers with a student spirit. And, you know, I always got to say, you know, I want honors thy ancestors, those who fought hard to get many of us in the space and the state that we're in. I always got to do that. I thank my ancestors. But it's something I wanted to touch on. You know, when we don't give in to dark forces, we won't become a host. Because a dark force, something evil, something bad, something that lies in the pit of our soul that's not good, you know, it needs a host. So if we don't give in to no dark forces, whether it's lusting, uh, lust, remember, many things can lead from lusting, whether it's lusting uh, after someone, money, attention, um, Things, lusting for things that's just not good for us, for our psyche, our mind, body, and soul. Some, if you listen to this channel, you know, I always talk about psyche because it is the center of everything, hands down. I don't care. You got your psyche straight, you be your own superhero. So let's go back to dark forces, evil forces, when we don't give in to them. And that could be porn, you know, uh, anything of a evil nature. You know, evil can't work without a host. So don't give in to parasitic. Parasitic, if I said that right, if I, I'm, I, you know, you know what I'm trying to say, parasite-like things. You know, what is it? We all know what a parasite is. So, and there's many parasites out here in the world, but especially on social media. So stay away, boycott dark, evil things, and you won't become a host because, like the movie Venom with Spider-Man, like with the movie Venom, and a lot of us have seen that movie. See how hard it was to, to, to pry that stuff up off of him? That's what it's like when we indulge in toxic, dark, evil things. And I don't give a damn how smooth you think you is or how many excuses you try to make or the justification that we... Because justification, you have to watch that, that word, justification. Because individuals that live in a dark life, evil life, they'll justify everything. And that's dangerous, you know. Only time we use that word... Or we have justification if it's for something righteous. But dark, evil things, malice, especially if you're connected to what? Family, children, significant other. That's something I always say. If you're connected to those, then you're going to affect those in your circle. That's why we don't attach ourselves to parasitic, parasitic, parasitic. I can't say that word. Parasite. I got to work on that word, y'all. Don't make fun of me. But no. Dark evil forces, like I said about the example a few minutes ago, about the venom, like the movie Spider-Man. You see, how it, it, it sticks to you. And the longer you ignore it, if you're doing bad things, that's not good for our mind, body, and soul. What we see here and feel, psyche, the seven, the seven, uh, what's that? Seven senses, I call it. The seven senses, mind, body, and soul. See, here and feel. Once you corrupt those seven things with doing dark, evil stuff that we know in our gut, that's not right. It's going to stick to us and it'll pop out when we least expect it. So that's why that's why you hear so many of us teachers say go within. I don't care how many times we hear that because once you finally do it, you'll find out why we hear that so much. So we can do what I just said, you know, so we won't become a host because, again, evil forces, the devil, dark, dark things that's evil, that's hidden from the world, whatever you want to put on it. It, it can't act or it can't live without a host. So don't be no host. You be that righteous brother or sister, young or old. I don't give a damn where you at. You stand firm because the great divine, the higher supreme being, God, that real God, not that false shit. You know, you never know what God, well, God knows, the real God now, great divine knows what's in store, but sometimes we don't. And why don't we know? Because we are not more powerful than God. And, you know, the real God, great divine, always know, know best as long as Mother Nature, universe, and Father Time. Appreciate Father Time. So that was just something that was in my spirit. Boycott all dark forces. Because if you don't and you keep, indulge, keep indulging in it, 
You know about that word karma, right? 